my family and thousands of others live on beautiful islands all across the Pacific Ocean. We are part of a very diverse region with many different languages, communities and cultures. However, we all live with one challenge. We are isolated. You know, the hospitality and welcome of the islands are legendary. You may have seen tourist pictures of these beautiful islands and many places we go are just like that. However, we have learned we don't have to be there very long and you see the devastating effects of isolation that these people live with. They have no way to obtain health care, dental care, vaccinations. So in that kind of situation, something as simple as a fever, a wound, an infection that sets in can become a life-threatening situation. During one of our recent trips to Papua New Guinea, we met a man named Abraham. He lived on an isolated island just north of Medang. He hadn't seen in over 17 years. And because of that, he'd lost his livelihood, he lost hope. His entire village couldn't wait for the YWAM ship to come in. After a simple 30 minute operation, sight returned to his eyes. In addition to Abraham, 10 others that day had their eyesight restored. These ships are creating a way to change thousands of people's lives, and hope is becoming a reality. In the last three years, we have seen over 900 students and volunteers provide more than 150,000 services in 284 villages. We have been invited by many government officials to bring services to their coastlines. It is incredible to see these doors open in partnership with the government. These germs make you sick. And that's why we're going to teach you so you know why you're washing your hands. On the big island of Hawaii, we are positioned in the heart of the Pacific Ocean. From here, we provide a platform for people to be trained, equipped, and engaged in the nations. We know that there are thousands of people in similar situations like Abraham. For people living on these isolated islands, ships aren't just a good idea, they are the only option. I can still remember the first time I saw a blind person see again. And in that moment, it was so much more than their sight being repaired. It was a restoration of their hope. And that's why it's so worth it. It's so worth it. This is the pure gospel. Jesus met people where they were at when he walked this earth centuries ago. He's still doing it today. I want to bring health care. I want to bring encouragement. I want to bring hope. I want to bring restoration. Transformation. Joy. Education. Compassion. Comfort. Change. Love. Truth. Mercy. Hope. 